What is up YouTube world and welcome back to the channel. On today's episode, we are going to be doing some more mini crawler stuff. As you can see from the table behind me, I just got my hands on a wicked cool new set of tires that just hit the market about a week ago. They are the Little Guy Racing Parts Black Label Tires. They are for the 1 24th scale mini crawlers. And these things have their new sticky compound, which I'm very, very excited about. Now, if you guys have seen these tires, and I'll kind of show you a little bit more up close and personal shortly, uh, they look and remind me exactly of the BFG crawler tires. Those are the red label competition sticky tires for full size vehicles. I'll show you guys a picture right here. Anyway, the BFG red labels and the Little Guy Racing Park black labels are very similar in tread pattern, sort of sidewall look, um, and obviously these are supposed to be a sticky compound tire as well as are the red label. So it's kind of cool. They kind of took little bits and pieces from that tire and made it in their own version of a mini size right on. So anyway, uh, I'm going to get these things mounted up on a new set of brass bead locks. We are going to get them on the mini crawler and we are going to hit the course. Um, now, as far as the tread pattern goes, um, you know, once again, it is almost identical to that BFG crawler tire. Uh, I would say it is identical. So same sort of shape lugs, um, same sort of cut pattern, you know, as in between the lugs. Um, except these uh, lugs on here are pretty meaty. Uh, they definitely, you know, stick out, you know, a lot more than I was expecting or than the pictures do justice. Uh, so I'm definitely pretty impressed with that. Definitely a sticky compound tire. Um, I actually noticed this before, but it's actually pretty funny. Uh, you could actually like pick up tires with a set of tires. So if I just press down lightly on a set, you know, I could pretty much take one of these tires and, and pick up the other tire. Let's see how many I could do. Let's see. Oh, there's all three. You know, some of the different Little Guy Racing Park tires that I have used in the past, as well as some of the Endure tires, um, these definitely have more of a sticky feel to them than I remember experiencing on any of those other tires. Anyway, time to get some bead locks on these bad boys so we can get these things tested out. So first off and first impressions, man, is, you know, these tires absolutely change the entire look of this vehicle. They are definitely very, very soft. I mean, you can you can just see like it's already, you know, kind of bulging, you know, at the bottom there. So um, it is just the stock foams that these things kind of come with. Nothing fancy. We're going to test them out exactly as is so we can get a from the package kind of feel and see how they do and handle and perform, which I am pretty pumped about, as I'm sure are you guys as well. So I'm gonna throw a battery in this bad boy. We are gonna get her on the course. We're gonna tackle some of the hardest lines that we have here, and let's see. Let's see if it hooks up a little bit better, and uh, let's see what all the hype's about. All right, guys, black label tires, first test and run on the new Extreme Course. Uh, I am running them on my little guy racing parts comp frame. Uh, this one has the X Factor chassis as well as I did a custom cut Jeep Gladiator body because if you know and you follow, I love all things Jeep. Um, so I'm going to run some of the same lines. If you guys saw a recent video I just put out, which is pretty much, uh, me building, uh, this extreme course that I have and just kind of doing some updates, um, to it. Uh, I'm going to run the same hard, hard lines that I ran with this exact same rig using the Swamp King tires. Um, and we're going to see how it does. So, so far it looks like I am hung up on my rear diff here. But she definitely is gripping insanely better. It just walked up that. If you guys watch the video that I just did on this course, 
Um, it pretty much, you know, what went up this line fairly easily, but what this just did just now is ridiculous. Uh, I am quite impressed because usually it kind of fights and struggles a little bit here. So, all right, time to up the ante. Let's get it on a little bit of a harder section. All right, so starting to fight it a little bit, definitely due to steepness, but I mean, overall, it's definitely biting a lot more than the Swamp Kings did. And it just walked right up that. I mean, I don't call it exactly a walk, but I mean, once again, guys, I literally just released a video on this course I ran it with this exact same rig on Swamp King tires, uh, and you can see how much it fought this hill climb uh, pre these tires. So, I mean, these things are just really, really grippy. I am just megally impressed. All right, guys, so this one gave me some fun, fun challenges last time. So, we're going to get her in there, see if uh, we can't make this line. A little bit easier with these tires. I'll get myself lined up here. And then we will give her a whirl. Once again, I can already tell that these tires, they are just biting in a lot more than the Swamp Kings were. Now granted, this section is still pretty tough. But I have a feeling if I can get the line, she's gonna do her thing. If I could work her over a little bit. What? All right, so goes to show you, if you find the right line, you can make things easier or harder. Uh, so once again, that section proves to be challenging still, which is exactly what I wanted. But once again, um, these tires hooked up and pulled a lot nicer than the Swamp Kings up in this area. And, you know, it's just, it's just making crazy work of this course last bonus line here just for fun i'll try the uh really steep section here right by the first tunnel uh and see i mean it did really good with the swamp kings i have no doubt that it's going to be very similar with this In fact, it just made that section even easier than it did. Killer. Well guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that review and sort of first test run with the new Little Guy Racing Parts Black Label Tires. I will say this, 
after using a bunch of different tires, you know, and, you know, kind of trying them out on a variety of different rigs, these are legit, hands down, probably my new favorite tire. Um, they hook, they grip. Uh, I actually might have to swap them out for the Swamp Kings from time to time just to challenge myself more on some of these lines because legit, you know, uh, and if you go back and you watch the video that I have of this course, you know, that I literally just did and ran with, those tires, the Swamp Kings, you know, make some of these lines like extremely challenging and these black labels pretty much just made some of those hard lines look really, really easy, which is crazy, crazy to think about. So, I mean, all in all, these black label tires are really, really dope. They look cool. They look just like the BFG crawler tires. I mean, it's pretty much a carbon copy. I don't care. They're awesome. I like the BFGs. The, um, the BFG tires are, are pretty much uh, what you'll see on a lot of like competition rigs uh, for like We Rock, um, you know, kind of X Rock on the East Coast and things like that we have. So those are a very big popular tire amongst like moon buggies and like full tube comp chassis. So, you know, something like that going into kind of the mini game is definitely really sweet. So anyway, definitely check them out for yourself. Make your own opinion. I am pumped. I'm excited. I'm actually going to stop filming, get this thing back on the course and just have some good old fun myself. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's review of these brand new tires. Definitely give this video a like if you guys enjoyed what you saw. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you guys think. If you guys have any questions and be sure to subscribe. And as always, guys, thanks for stopping by. God bless. And I'll catch you guys next time.